More than 24 hours after three people were shot in Jefferson Hills. A lot of questions remain tonight. Lauren Linder is live at Allegheny County Police Headquarters with what she's learned. Lauren. Can Allegheny County Police tell me the two people who survived the shooting in Jefferson Hills remain in the hospital? Now multiple sources are telling me the fight that started it all may have had to do with a relationship between one family's son and another family's daughter. It was horrible. Chaos filled the neighborhood off Siler Drive in Jefferson Hills Sunday afternoon. This man, who doesn't want to be identified for his safety, says he was in his family room on the first floor of his home. I heard a commotion, people were hollering and yelling at one another. He looked out his front window and saw a man in a truck and people at the house across the street hollering at each other. He heard the man say these exact words. Your son is, is a problem. A woman who he says lives at the home was walking away from the man who was flailing what appeared to be a stick or pipe in the air. Then all of a sudden, uh, they said, uh, go, go away, go away, we're going to call the police. The neighbor watched the man go to his truck. He thought he was going to leave. Instead, well, he pulled out a gun, and he whipped around and pointed it at the house. He says the man didn't fire, but seconds later, he heard gunshots and ran away from the windows. The next thing he knew, he saw the man in the truck's brother come down the street. And he yelled to them. You shot my brother. The neighbor looked back out and saw the man and his brother walking down his driveway. The man was shot, was holding his stomach like this, and they were walking down. By then, SWAT and police swarmed the community. That's when he realized two others were shot. Allegheny County police say 48-year-old Jason Steiner died in the shooting. A woman and another man remain in critical but stable condition. Investigators will not say how the three people are connected. I'm a heart patient and I was actually getting palpitations. You know, I had bypass surgery and that's the worst I felt in 15 years since I've had it. The neighbor says he doesn't know who fired first, but saw several people taken away in handcuffs. Whatever happened between them was terrible. Now, another person who lives in the area tells me people who live in the neighborhood are scared of those who live in that home on Siler Drive and that police are always responding there. At this time, no one is in custody. The case remains under review. For now, reporting live outside Allegheny County Police Headquarters, Lauren Linder, Kitty K, TV News.